heroes of America, the technicians, the entertainers, the commentators, the administrative personnel, daily unite their efforts in the creation of programs that please and entertain the vast radio Top of the Saturday, TV Monkey Dots, and welcome aboard. It's me, Jack, here on This Week in the Monkey House. Whoa, your radio time machine back to recent history here at the house. As you can hear, I have already had my first cup of coffee, and I'm going to be with you for the next four hours of fun right here in the Monkey House to uh, catch you up on some things that maybe you missed the first time around or to do a victory lap of uh, recent he uh, history right here in the house. Uh, but as always, we kick off this week in the Monkey House with a little dive into the old uh, Live from the Monkey House uh, voicemail inbox. And if you want to leave a voicemail, you know you can do it right now, right? It's true. Just call us at 1-866-328-2345. That's 1-866-328-2345. Press 1 for the Monkey House and tell us what's going on with you this weekend. I am Avery from Florida. Hey, Avery. And I have a great idea for the party bus. Oh! Maybe um, a petting zoo? A petting zoo and a party bus? Bye. Oh, Avery, I know what you're talking about. Uh, just recently here in the Monkey House, just a couple days ago, we brainstormed the ultimate party on wheels, a 1973 big yellow school bus that slowly but surely we converted into a party bus. How do you do this? Well, uh, first you got to get your hands on an old school bus that's getting easier and easier these days as the uh, final days of school are ticking past and we're finding our way in an actual summertime. And by the way, to everyone out there who has officially made it to summertime here on our long Memorial Day weekend, a very happy summer to you. It's so magical. It's summertime. Well, uh, now that your school bus is no longer being used for uh, picking up people after school or dropping off people at school, well, I think we got to make sure to get some use this summer, don't you? That's why converting it into a party bus sounds like a great idea. All you have to do is find some amenities that people are going to love. That's right. So Avery's idea of a petting zoo on a school bus, imagine that, just animals running up and down the aisles, and you can stay there comfortably in your seat and just pet the animals as they pass by. That is a can't-miss way to inject a little summer fun into your bus experience. And when we come back, oh boy, I can't wait to take you for a spin. I'm going to warn you, this party bus uh, is already pretty awesome. I installed a customized horn that plays either La Cucaracha or Polly Wally Doodle. Uh, spoiler alert, it's going to play La Cucaracha. I mean, who really wants to hear Polly Wally Doodle? And yes, we've got an understory of funk music to keep the party going all hour long. But now that we've got animals as part of the party bus, man, my spirits are rising steadily.